G'day Terry, Nick here from Advantage Cars. This is just the walk around video that we talked about uh, earlier in the day. So we'll just start around the front bumper here on the Mazda 6. So the front bumper is really, really tidy. There's no real stone chips or anything to speak of on the bumper, which is really nice. Um, you see you've got your front parking sensors built in there as well. Up on the bonnet, the bonnet's nice and tidy. The car's a bit dusty at the moment, just from sitting, but our groomers will get stuck into that and clean it right up for you before it's delivered. Um, no real stone chips on the bonnet. There's, there's the odd ones if you kind of go hunting for them. You'll find the odd mark, but nothing that really catches your eye. Okay, round to the side here. This is the, the driver's side quarter panel. Well, the front, front guard is really, really nice. No real damage on that at all that I can see. Um, really good tyres on this as well. Still heaps of life left in those. A little bit of curbing on the mags. Nothing too excessive. Generally nice and tidy on there driver's door and uh, sort of pillar there is much the same no real damage or anything that jumps out at you that you can sort of catch your eye on I think the only piece that I noticed was there's a bit of bit of chipping just on the inside there of the uh, of the driver's door back door really really nice as well no real damage there at all that I can see much the same with the roof the roof's really tidy a little dirty as I mentioned but like I said to get a full groom and that'll all come right out and be nice and shiny for you. Back quarter panel, really nice, no real damage or anything on that either, nothing to speak of really. Again a touch of curbing on the on the rims, nothing major but just you know just a little bit of curb rash. Um, and so we get really good tyre on here still, it's a full matching set of tyres. The uh, full Bridgestone tyres on there, the Tenzers I think, are they? No, no. Terenzas, sorry, the T001, so yeah, really, really good tyre on there. Round on the rear bumper here, rear bumper is pretty much perfect, the only thing I noticed there, there's a little bit of scuffing on the plastic sort of lip right at the bottom, but that's, that's it, boot lids nice and tidy, nothing really happening there. Around the back of the bumper there, the rest of it is yeah, really tidy as well. Reversing sensors and reversing camera on that as well. Guard on this side again is, is sort of the same, it's really really nice. There's maybe like a slight dent you just see there just in the, the colour shift. But you know, and another tiny one there. So there's, you know, it's an odd little mark but it's, it's you know, really hard to pick up. Back door here, nice and tidy there as well. There's maybe like a little bit of scratch there, but that's it on this door. Um, up on the driver's door, oh, driver, passenger front, sorry. That seems to be in really good condition as well. No scratches or anything that I can see there. There is, have the mirror cap has got a couple of scratches on it there. So we'll see what the other groomers can do. They should be able to get a bit of that out, but that is probably the, the worst piece on the cars. They're just a bit of scratching on the uh, on the mirror cap. Front guard, really, really nice as well. No real damage there. Again, matching set of tires, heaps of tread on them. This rim is actually pretty tiny. There's just a tiny bit of curbing just there. But generally that one's really tidy. Um, I'll pop back, miss the, uh, the other one, the back passenger side. So that's that's the worst of the curbing of it there. So that's probably the the worst rim of the lot. But even it's just sort of some curbs that they've just clipped parking, but nothing major on there. And you know, good tires on that as well. Okay, and that's us all the way back around the front there. Really nice looking car. Looks good in the sun as well. But you know, like I said, with a groom it'll come out even nicer, it's got a bit of a coating of dust on it at the moment. Um, so we'll jump into the driver's seat for you there. So, interior on this, really tidy. The seats, no rips, no tears, nothing like that, you know. As you'd expect with a vehicle that's not that old. Floor mats are all really nice, steering wheels in great condition. Yeah, the other door card. 
nothing weird going on there either, it's all nice. Off in inside there, it's all nice and tidy. The, uh, the tray cover, that's all good as well, no damage or anything on there. Your screen in the centre there. Passengers much the same. A little bit of dirt in there that will, will vacuum out and, and groom it all out for you. Door card on that side is really good as well. Dash, perfect. No, you know, sort of marks or fading or discoloration on the dash there either. So that's really, really good. Yeah. Into the back, much the same story here. The back doesn't really look like it's been uh, been used very much. Seats are all really great condition. As the front, no rips, no tears, nothing like that. Backs of the driver's seats are really good as well. Nothing going on there. Good condition there again as well. Door cards are good. And same with the uh, door card on that side. No damage at all. All right, and then lastly, we'll pop round to the boot for you. So there's your reversing camera just there. Heaps of space in the boot there as well. So really nice condition there. We've got a spare tire and everything located in there. So that's all set. You're all ready to go there as well. I'll try uh, pop open the front for you as well. See if we can just have a quick look under the bonnet. Right, I'll see if we can do this one-handed. Right, there we go. So under there, it's nice and tidy as well. Really good condition here too. I mean, as you'd expect, big ASB lease vehicle, so it's really been looked after serviced on time, all the rest of it, so really, really good condition. All right, well that's it, yeah, that concludes our walk around video there for you, so yeah, hope you enjoyed the uh, Mazda 6 there, and um, I'll be in contact. All right, cheers.